We want secure and safe schools and we want gun laws that won't make it so easy for the bad guys to get these damn guns. Hey there, YouTube fam. Today we've got a thought-provoking and insightful dive into the world of politics and public figures. Get ready for an eye-opening journey as we dissect Matthew McConaughey's stand on gun control that left the view panel in awe. It's time to break free from the labels and dive into the nuances of political discourse. Before we jump in, make sure to comment below with your thoughts. Hit that like button, subscribe, and ring that notification bell. Let's spark a conversation that goes beyond the surface. Let's roll. I've seen a lot of celebrities come to the White House on various causes, but I have never seen somebody do quite what you did. Defying labels, McConaughey's stance on gun control. Matthew McConaughey, a Texan with a heart for change, has been an outspoken advocate against violence, especially gun violence. His commitment took center stage with the launch of the Green Lights Grant Initiative, a game changer in the quest to make schools safer. Matthew McConaughey clip, the government wants these grants to be filed. They want to spend the money. It's use it or lose it money. And if we don't spend that money that the government has by 2026, it could be reallocated. That's money to pay for mental health resources and security for safer schools to ensure that our kids can learn in peace and without fear. McConaughey sheds light on a critical issue. The bureaucratic hurdles preventing schools from accessing funds meant for safety measures. This initiative reflects not just words, but action, showcasing his dedication to tangible change. But the actor's involvement doesn't stop there. In the aftermath of the Robb Elementary High School shooting, McConaughey took the stage at the White House, delivering a speech that echoed his commitment to responsible gun ownership. Matthew McConaughey clip. We need responsible gun ownership, background checks raising the minimum age. These are reasonable, practical regulations. It's not just about restrictions. McConaughey emphasizes responsibility, weaving a narrative that goes beyond mere gun control. Gun access is uh, certainly a driver of, of this violence. Political chess, McConaughey's tactful response to Joy Bihar. Now let's talk about the recent appearance of Matthew McConaughey on The View. In a political landscape that often pushes individuals to choose sides, McConaughey's masterful handling of a discussion on gun control is a lesson in navigating the tricky waters of political discourse. The stage is set, the view panel discussing gun control. Joy Bihar, ever the provocateur, throws a loaded question at Matthew McConaughey, attempting to label him as anti-gun. Do you think you could get elected in Texas being anti-gun? To give you a direct statement right there is yeah. be playing a game that I'm not interested in playing. Okay. Matthew McConaughey clip. One thing about me in politics is to give you a direct statement right there is me playing a game that I'm not interested in playing. McConaughey's response is a strategic move, a refusal to be pigeonholed into a divisive narrative. It's a masterstroke in political chess, demonstrating his unwillingness to conform to the labels society often imposes. Later, when asked about his political future, McConaughey responds with tact, hinting at the possibility, but with a condition, if it's where he deems himself most useful. Matthew McConaughey clip, if it's where I would deem myself to be most useful, yeah, yes. What's fascinating here is not just the rejection of labels, but McConaughey's refusal to play the game of political polarization. The Second Amendment defenders could talk responsibility. They could look you in the eye and talk responsibility with someone from the other side of the aisle. Beyond words, analyzing McConaughey's White House speech. Examining McConaughey's speeches, especially at the White House after the Robb Elementary High School shooting, reveals a nuanced perspective on gun control. His words were carefully chosen, emphasizing the need for responsible gun ownership. Matthew McConaughey clip, we need responsible gun ownership, responsible gun ownership. We need background checks, we need to raise the minimum age to purchase an AR-15 rifle to 21. We need a waiting period for those rifles. We need to raise the minimum age to purchase an AR-15 rifle to 21. We need red flag laws and consequences for those who abuse them. These are reasonable, practical, tactical regulations to our nation, states, communities, schools, and homes. Responsible gun owners are fed up with the Second Amendment being abused and hijacked by some deranged individuals. These regulations are not a step back, they're a step forward for a civil society and the Second Amendment. Notice the precision in his language. It's not merely about control, but responsible ownership. 
McConaughey navigates the sensitive topic with a call for practical regulations, avoiding the pitfalls of divisive rhetoric. His plea for a civil society, where responsible gun owners are not overshadowed by the actions of a few, speaks volumes. McConaughey carefully crafts a message that goes beyond party lines, focusing on what unites us rather than what divides. This commitment isn't just verbal. The Green Lights Grant Initiative, dispersing over $2 billion for school safety, is a tangible representation of McConaughey's dedication to action. Now, part of this bill sets aside billions of dollars to make American schools safer. Bridging divides, McConaughey as a conversational catalyst. Matthew McConaughey's refusal to be pinned down to a political camp is more than just a personal choice. It's a deliberate effort to bridge the ever-widening gap in our polarized political climate. His ability to speak to diverse audiences, from Joe Rogan to The View, showcases a unique position, a vital conversational bridge in a time when communication lines are often severed. The Green Lights, Grant Initiative, dispersing funds for school safety, is not just a policy. It's a grassroots effort translating words into impactful initiatives. McConaughey exemplifies that actions speak louder than words. But why is he so uncomfortable being lured into a political camp? McConaughey understands the danger of painting broad strokes, dismissing the complexity of issues, and hindering genuine conversations. In a world where morality often obscures understanding, McConaughey's call for genuine conversation challenges us to see beyond the labels. So, the next time you're tempted to see issues in black and white, remember McConaughey's call for understanding. Let's strive for a safer country, finding common ground through tough conversations. As Matthew McConaughey exemplifies, we need bridges, not barriers. On her feet, it turned out to be the only clear evidence that could identify her after the shooting. How about that? And there you have it, folks. The fascinating journey through Matthew McConaughey's nuanced stance on gun control and political discourse. In a world often divided, McConaughey stands as a beacon of conversation, refusing to be labeled and urging us all to think beyond the binaries. As we navigate the complexities of these issues, let's remember that genuine understanding requires more than just labels. It demands open minds, tough conversations, and a commitment to find common ground. Matthew McConaughey isn't just a celebrity. He's a catalyst for meaningful dialogue. His actions from the Green Lights Grant Initiative to his carefully chosen words speak louder than the noise of political polarization. Before we sign off, make sure to share your thoughts in the comments below. Hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't, and don't forget to share this video. Let's keep the conversation alive, breaking down barriers and building bridges. Remember, it's not about left or right, red or blue. It's about understanding, empathy, and creating a better world for all. Until next time, stay engaged, stay informed. I'm a fan of Matthew McConaughey as an actor.